I finally got the raven, but I can't good, get a good enough shot of him because I'm behind the screen. That's the raven. You see how big he is compared to the to the other. Oh, there he goes again. I can never get him up close. Darn it. he's back. If he hears me, he's going to fly off again. And the crows are crowing. Nobody wants to eat with him. They all move away from him. Oh, there's another one. They're huge. So there's two ravens back there. You see how huge they are compared to the crows? They're like twice the size of the crow. And there's one that's like three times the size of a crow. And their beak is a little bit more broader than a crow. Here's the other one. They're really hard to get. Um, don't know that much about ravens, but I think they're omnivores. Um, they're back there eating the, um, the seeds that I put out. And I put some berries and some nuts back there. I even sprinkled a little bit of banana chips out there. This is the closest I can get to them uh, from my yard. And I hate filming behind the screen. And it's a cloudy day, so um, I can't get any, um, can't really get good resolution. But it's even light, but you can see the proportion of it, you know, the size of it. Uh, all the other birds are keeping their distance because these birds are not uh, from over here. I think they came from the park. I wish I could get... If I open the door, he's going to fly off. So I haven't been able to get them up close, any closer than this. And I've been trying to get them at the park. So I guess it's a uh, male and female, possibly, or two males. You can see how it's it's a big bird, really big bird. I will try to enlarge it as much as I can without getting the screen. They're on my roof now. The hard little footsteps too. They're all feeding on what's left. I just wanted to show the size, if you can see the size, the uh, proportion wise of the birds. Those are blue jays. See, everybody's back there now because the raven left. But when the ravens come back, everybody's going to scatter. There are um, 
mostly doves back there, blue jays, and squirrels. And um, you can see how small they are compared to the raven. But I believe ravens, ravens are also birds of prey because they're omnivores. So I do believe that they would easily uh, overpower a sparrow and have it for dinner. But this is what it looks like when everybody's back there eating. If I can get it. Uh, I have a tripod, but I have not um, set it out there because I don't have anything to anchor it on. And I know they will just knock it over and possibly damage my camera. So that's why I haven't put it out there. Well, I got to go cook. Um, today is the 4th of July. I hope they get a chance to eat something and go hide from all the noise. These folks over here started celebrating flying rockets last night. And so um, I know what it's going to be like today. And I just hope that uh, the little ones will be okay. You know, because they don't like those loud noises. Neither do I. But um, that's what the, what, the, um, what the Gentiles like to do. So... Um, I don't celebrate. Um, I don't uh, do 4th of July. I don't think that's anything for me to celebrate. But I am going to celebrate these little ones out here today. Sweet blessings of the Most High. These are His creatures. And they are beautiful. So if we take care of nature, nature will take care of us. Shalom. Shalom, babies. Be safe. Shalom. Now it clears up. <laughs> if I hold the camera just right, you won't see the screen. It has something to do with the rays of the sun. Now that's the picture I've been trying to get all day. Fascinating. Shalom, babies. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom, everybody. Bye.